Hello, what's up guys? I'm back again with another video tutorial. Today in this video tutorial, we're going to look into GoodNote. So basically, today I'm going to show you that how to add a link in GoodNote and basically if you have something on the task, something to do, and it has to go to some other app, and then you don't want to go back and forth, you want everything in detail in there, in the GoodNote, how to do that. So, uh, this is a very good way of organizing your activities or your notes, your data that you have entered there all the information you can organize them in a, a very good manner if you uh, can link you know add external links to the note so to do that here i have this note as you can see this is an example note of that a meeting then a uh, flight and then yeah making junior out and there is another tab that says cook uh, this is memories right now what we're going to do is we are going to see that there's an uh, highlighted uh, event at flight switzerland now what's going to what we're going to do is uh, our objective is to you know uh, let's say I have uh, booked a hotel and so now what I, what I want to do is I want to basically um, link that hotel uh, or the TripAdvisor's hotel link to that particular flight. So when I click on that on the to-do list, it just takes me to that hotel. So here I have Zurich a hotel here. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply copy the link of um, this hotel because I don't want to go back and forth with this right so I just click on the uh, you know um, URL tab and just click on there and copy the link and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to click here and add a text box as you can see there is this option on the top the T with a box in it right now what I'm going to do is uh, the T within the box so I'm going to do click on that and add this box here and what I'm going to do is in the default style I'm going to just uh, press space instead of uh, writing anything so it's going to be blank right so I can uh, press space five or six times and then it's going to be adding a blank and what, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to select it basically because uh, space is still even though there is nothing but to the to the system to the PC or to the app it is still a corrector right it still is a bit even though we can't see it so what I'm going to do is double tape on it and it's going to select it now what we're going to do is we're going to slide it to the next side and then we're going to get the option of link and now once you click on link, it's basically this window is going to open up the edit link. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to basically uh, enter the link, paste the link here and then go back and then uh, press return basically and then here back, go back. And now when I go back, as you can see, there is nothing basically to see on there. It's just simply as that there is flight to Switzerland. But now when I click, if I go into normal mode, exit the edit mode, as you can see, there is nothing there. It's just a simple text. Now, but if I click on that flight Switzerland, it's going to say that an external link is detected. And if you click yes, it simply takes me to the page link that I just copied. So this is how you add a link to the good notes, right? Now, there's a, there are pretty different ways or different approaches. Let's say there is a... Um, and another task is to make, make gingerbread cookies. So now what I want to do is I want to add the recipe there too. So let's suppose I found a good recipe there on the internet or a YouTube video and I want to link that there so I won't forget it. So I can simply again go copy the link and simply again go to edit mode and in edit mode again add the text box there. And in the text box again I'll add some spaces. And after adding some spaces, what I'm going to do is again double tap, select all. And once all is selected, I'm going to go to the next. There, as you can see, there is this little button. It shows to uh, it shows on the right side, right? I'm click on that. And after that, what's going to happen is it's going to show the link. I'm just copy the paste the link there, and then go done. Exit edit mode. And now when I click on make a gingerbread, it's going to take me to the external link. And similarly, we can do this for pictures too. So if we have some picture there and then we want to add a link to that picture to a social media site or any social media post, we can do that. So here I'll load up a video, a picture actually. I'm going to load up a picture here and I just place it on the GoodNote board, right? We're going to add it here in the GoodNote board and all I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Instagram and from Instagram, I'm just, as you can see, there's this video, this post. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy the link of this post and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and add another text box there, fill it with blanks. And after filling it with blanks, what I'm going to do is select all, go to the right side, link, add the link there, and just go out of exit, exit out of edit mode. And then after that, when I tape on the picture, basically what I'm going to do is place the box on the picture. So whenever I click the picture, basically I'm clicking the box and the box is hyperlinked to that post, right? When I click that, it's basically going to take me to the app and then, yeah, that's how we add links 
to different uh, of different site to our uh, good note okay so I hope you found this video helpful if you did please drop a like comment if you have any question and subscribe for more videos like this one I'll see you in the next one peace